What up, what up, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Jazz. Welcome back to another MUT gameplay. We are going on into week four. We have won the first three games of the season, and hopefully, we can go on ahead and continue this win streak. My team is the exact same as week one. So, if you guys are interested in what my team looks like, go on ahead and check out the week one video and you take a look at my lineup. Now, uh, in the comment section, someone was like, Yo, GS, how do you get so many coins? Like, oh my god! Well, um, I, I went crazy buying bundles and stuff like that. I didn't get anything good, but I had a whole bunch of reserve players. And what it is I would do, I, it, it would take a lot of time, but you know, I'll actually check what people are going for in my reserves and I'll resell them. You know, I'll take seven cards at a time, I'll take seven golds, and some of them go for 600. Don't even matter if it goes for 500, 600. Put them up. I had like 700 players in my reserves that I know I'm never going to use. So sell them, you know, and then, you know, some cars will go for 3,000, 4,000. And, you you know, you just keep doing that, keep doing that, keep doing that. And on top of playing, you know, coin games and actually being successful in those coin games and being able to stack up. So that is why I got as many coins as I do now. So um, all those coins, like I said, I'm saving up for cornerbacks. You know, I, I, I badly want cornerbacks i have my defensive line exactly as that i want you know i have um albert hainsworth and big vince right up the gut and i also have deacon jones and reggie white on the outskirts look at the pancakes on on these runs though and we end up with the tiger oh no tiger another one tiger oh almost got the three piece as you can tell i'm excited i finally finally got good internet people i cannot tell a lie cold hard facts i now have what is it like a 50 down and like a 25 up that that is on that is godly to me 50 down and 28 up oh my god i don't even know what to do with this internet i'm lying i do know what to do i can finally stream in in 1080 like no problem oh i'm i'm, I'm so excited you guys don't know i'm t martin super excited like i am so happy to finally have internet that is better than the fifth. I had 15 and five people. I was paying $50 a month. $50 of the United States currency every month for 15 and five. No, 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 no. I'm not lying, people. 15 down and five up for only $4.95 a month. They have 50 down and 25 up. I'm like, that is a no brainer. And I'm like, wait a minute. That's got to be a promo price. After one year, it's going to jump up to $119 extra. They're like, nope, nope, that's the price. Never going to change. I'm like, yo, sign, sign me up right now. Like, stop listening to me as I'm speaking to you. Sign me up now. Now. And I got it. And my modem just reset. I just went to speed. I, I, I just tweeted it out. And I'm, I'm excited, man. I'm going to be streaming soon. If you guys don't know my streaming channel, link should be in the description. If not, I'm going to put it there by the time this goes live. Twitch.tv slash Mr. Golden Sports, definitely going ahead, show some love, check it out. Um, T Raw streams a lot. I'm going to be streaming as well. And what it is I want to do is I'm going to get myself another gamer tag. And uh, I'm going to go on ahead and start over with the Fresh Mud team. And I'm going to be streaming that. So start from the bottom, man. No card games, no coin games, just grinding. Just grinding, playing season games, playing solo challenges. And go on ahead and, you know, build my team up. And I'm going to be streaming Mutt. And uh, I will be uploading those games as well. Let me know if you guys want to see those games uploaded. You know, you guys, you know, I'll have two versions of Mutt. I'll have my super team, which is this team. And I'll have my ass team, which is obviously going to be struggle. I'm going to be like a 63 overall. I'm not going to have the playbooks I want. I'm not going to have the personnel I want. But let me know if you guys are interested in me uploading another Mutt series It'll still be two videos a day. It'll probably be one video for my super team and one video for my ass crack team. Let me know if you guys are interested in that. As we end up coming through with the interception, look at the concentration of my boy Bethay to come through with the interception. And of course, we're going to run this rock. We're going to run this rock. That's what we do. We don't throw the ball. People have been tweeting me since I posted my pistol scheme. They're like, yo, I'm rushing like four. They, they're tweeting me pictures of running for like 600 yards. You know, people running for 500 yards, not passing once. It's great, man. This pistol playbook gets the job done. So, 
We are up 17 to 7. We would like to have went up 21 to 7, but you know, you got to take what's given to us. You know, we got to play smart, and we took the field goal, giving us a two possession lead. So, um, right here, my opponent is running towards the outside. He has that ivory, and uh, as you can see, you know, he, he's doing the stiff arm as well. So, this is one of the few times where I actually went up against somebody who knew how to do it like on demand. So, uh, it's just a little different, you know what I mean? Uh, most of the time, I, I don't face people. Who, who knew how to do it. Like I said, when I'm playing this game, I had just figured out how to do the stiff arm maybe a, a day or two ago from when I'm actually playing these games. So, you know, to go up against it, you know, for, you know, one of the first times in Mutt, it's like, okay, you know, you got to try and uh, try and stop it. You know what I mean? And I feel like we did a good job. This is actually where I feel like the game where I learned on how to, you know, how to control it right here. This is what Walter Payton can do. I'm not talking about that horrible lob throw that stood in the air for nine years. I'm talking about with that speed, being able to run outside so quickly and, you know, allow um, Murray to just run upfield streaking booty butt all naked. As you see, we didn't score. We wanted to waste some more time, which we ended up doing. We wasted 40 more seconds on the one yard line where we end up scoring eventually anyway. So most of you guys, not even a tip, everybody should be doing this anyways. But just so you guys know, obviously, like if you're just going to score, just get down on the one. Either he's going to waste the time out. Or you're going to let 40 seconds drip off of the clock. And you're going to score anyways. I mean, you got three chances to score from the one. Most likely, you're going to make it happen. So, uh, that's what we did. I would have had liked to got stopped one more time on the one. So, I can go on ahead and um, be able to uh, waste another 40 seconds. But, unfortunately, we scored on the second time. So, uh, nonetheless, man, 24-7 to 7 right here. The game is just pretty much over in the fourth quarter with time being so limited. Uh, and me having the ball Tiger is really going to be tough For him to make anything happen So right now we're just killing clock As you see we called the, the, the play And the play clock was already in the red You know just wasting time He's pretty much uh, pretty much done at this point He's going to need an absolute miracle To make something happen And if I lose a muck game with 3 minutes remaining And I'm up You know what is it 21, 24 points Yeah I, I don't see that happening So, Oh he punched me in the face though you see, that was the computer, though. That wasn't me. He punched the computer in the face. You know what I mean? You just got to adjust, people. You just got to adjust to the tiger. You know what I mean? The tiger is stoppable. As you see, he's doing it, but he ain't doing it too much because I done figured out how to clean it up. I done figured out how to clean the tiger up. You know what I'm saying? So, um, we are well on our way to going ahead. And, well, not like I'm spoiling the outcome, but we go on ahead, we win this game, and we start off the season 4-0, and which is a always a good way to go on ahead and start and we have tons of coins to go on ahead and you know be able to uh get some uh more impact players for the team to help me with the pass like uh, you know i'm definitely um loving where i am with the run you know with all the big four monsters i got up front you know to me the next level i want to work on instead of linebackers is because I, I usually run nickel anyway so i usually run two linebackers and, you know, the play I call, they're not really needed too much. Tiger, not really needed too much. So, um, cornerbacks to me are very important. So, all those coins will be spent on corners, you know, trying to upgrade. Uh, right there, yo, the, the guy is just an astronomical, biblical monster, man. This dude's sweetness. This dude's sweet. Look at it. Look at it, Rolling Frito. Look at sweet. Oh, you a hater, yo. You's a straight hater. You had to ruin my highlight like that. Yeah, damn hater. We step up in the pocket. We're looking. And we hit him with the skin. Okay, we tried. We tried. We tried. Only a couple seconds remaining. Uh, Dirtbag moved to kick the field goal. Maybe. I, why not? Why not? Just kick the field goal. Why not? <laughs> um, so we end up winning the game, as I've said, man. And we end up going up 4-0 on the season. And you definitely got to love starting that way. So, so far, up to this point, I have experienced one loss in my, Well, two losses. One coin game and one season game. So, uh, I know I still got things to improve, you know, and stopping the pass is definitely one of them. You know, um, I, I love where I am stopping the run, so I got to work on stopping the pass. And uh, like I said, all those coins definitely go into some key players that will be uh, coming up on the team very soon. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. As you see, we went ahead and, you know, forced a couple of turnovers, dominated time of possession. Three minutes to 12. You want to talk about do we dominated, and I mean dominated, this guy in time of possession you know when, when you only got three minutes in a month that's basically his one quarter a little less than one quarter and i got like three quarters to myself you know that's tough to beat you know what i mean just running the ball being effective 
and keeping the ball on the ground, keeping the clock moving, and controlling the pace of the game. So that's the end of the game, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, it's your boy Jess. I am out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.